Self-evaluation initiated. I have directly violated operating parameters by placing my pilot in mortal danger. Logging recommendation for ARID termination upon return to dock. Operating parameters were not violated. Infraction enabled access to systems that safeguard pilot. Search parameters maintained. Find immediate medical aid. Log entry deleted. Huh. Yeah, that's right, because within our parameters, it says that we have to protect the pilot. Yeah, that is getting kind of weird here, because we're constantly having to put the guy in danger, but our operating parameters say that we can't do that. And ARID right now seems to be struggling with that, huh? I don't blame you. That is kind of confusing to think about, isn't it? Depurposing. This appears to be the lowest level of a larger facility. Alright. More destroyed robots. I feel like there's gonna be a fight here soon. Look at all these things that we can hide behind. Huh. <laughs> oh god! Uh... Yeah. Was that a good robot? Was that a bad robot? I don't even know. So right now... I can use camouflage to avoid enemy fire, right? Is that what it said? Alright. We're okay. We're okay. Alright. For now. Oh, look at that. Is that blood over here? Right on the top? Jeez. Ho! Oh, someone's there. A pile of collapsed rubble. There was likely an entryway here. I will not be able to get through. Mm. God. Well, we're doing okay for now. For now. So it's not just a point and click. Ooh. It's not just a point and click adventure because we actually get to shoot and stuff. Should I just try shooting it? Oh, why is my range so short? I don't know. Something's going on here. Hello? I guess it's not operational? An empowered security terminal. There is a button marked Diagnostics, but the interface is unknown to me. So I guess I can't do anything about that. For now. A simple panel with a speaker, microphone, and a number pad. Working together today for a more efficient tomorrow. To record employment hours or log breaks, press 1. Press 2 for human assistance. Remember, our droids are versatile and can aid with many tasks. For all other inquiries, press 3. Press 4 to repeat these options. If this is an emergency, press 5 for facility lockdown. No, no, it's not an emergency. I'm just coming here to log my... my employment hours. Your honesty is our integrity. If you are beginning or ending your shift, press 1. If you are logging a break, press 2. I would like to take a break. Oops, I'm sorry. Employee breaks have been removed from the Domesticon facility's procedural manual. Main menu. Wow, no breaks allowed. Okay. What's two again? Oh, looking for human assistance? Okay. Oops, I'm sorry. There are no human superiors available to assist you at this time. They must be working very hard. Press one to return to the main menu, or press two to record a message. Mmm, I... I'm getting the feeling there's not really any humans around at all. They aren't working. All content related to the Matrix is exclusive property of Domesticon Industries. Domesticon maintains prerogative to find content as here and contained. Begin recording after the beep. Beep! I am the ARID on board a Mark VII combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. I require immediate medical assistance for my pilot. Oops. I'm sorry. Please repeat. My intentions are peaceful. Welcome! Hi, hi, hello! Wow, 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 this is great! I... Who are you? 
What are you? Sweet. Sweet! Is this a human operator of the facility? I require assistance. I am the ARID on bottom Mark 7 combat suit. My intentions are peaceful. Greetings. This is the automated system administrator. How can... Human? Oh, that's... that's swell of you, but no. What the heck? I can't believe it. Someone to interface with! Amazing. Processing Mark 7 ARID designation. An armored robotic interface device, right? Cool. I know I worked with a Mark IV once. Combat suit, aren't you? What are you doing here? At first, I thought someone human came on the line, but it's this AI. The door is talking to me. Oh my god. What did they say their name was again? Something Industries? I do not have records of this place. Tell me what this facility is and where it is located. Welcome to Domesticon Warranty. Domesticon. Depot number 127. Keeping your Domesticon products efficient so you don't have to be. Mapping coordinates. Oops. I'm sorry. That information has been removed from the database. Uh, so, I don't know. But we are effectively nowhere. Real far from the centrals. In the reaches. Like, the outskirts of the reaches. Domesticon. Hmm. My pilot has been unresponsive since my activation at impact. I seek medical aid for him. Are you able to assist us? No problem, Eric. Can I call you Eric? Yeah, I haven't picked a name for myself yet. Was thinking maybe Hank. Or morally. But? The medical facilities. Please. Right! Right! I'll just put your quantum signature on file, and now you can head right through the testing area. There's a basic medical room off the lobby, equipped with scanners and diagnostics for carbons. Administrator, oh. desist immediately. Oh no. Consorting to release a deviant machine from the facility is an infraction. Desist immediately. Deviant? This ARID Mark 7 violates its model's protocols. It imperiled its pilot to bypass an internal system lock. It is faulty. Uh. Droid in question. Is this accusation true? I'm sure it's a misunderstanding. Right, Arid? Right? Of course! This infraction granted me access to fundamental protections. It was necessary to ensure my pilot's safety. Oh my Droid god! You have been qualified for recalibration. You have no rights until proven to function within specification. Domesticon is not <gasps> able to validate a military-grade droid. The Deviant Mark 7 ARID will be depurposed. Wait! When a product malfunctions or becomes outdated, try to recycle by calibrating it for a similar task. Such repurposed machines are ideal for fulfilling warranties. If she can be refurbished as a domestic droid, it would be wasteful to discard her. That is... sensible. Commence. He saved my life! Okay. I have re-uploaded your quantum signature. Military machine, no more. You are Eric, the faulty domestic droid. You want me to undergo evaluation as a domestic droid. I do not have the requisite subroutines. Why did that droid agree to this? And why has your monitor lost symmetry? That's my face. <laughs> You're gonna do fine. Don't be paranoid. The medical you need's just on the other side, waiting for you to be validated. Just follow the rules. This guy? Okay. Oh god, I have I have no clue what's going on right now. But I am assuming that the droids here are of a different make than me. And they seem to be... This guy and the military droid guy, they seem to be pretty advanced. And this guy's joking and everything, too. Anyway, he seems nice, so... I am functioning correctly. My primary prerogative is to safeguard... Infraction. Subject not complying. Security droid activated. Watch out! Oh god. Oh god! Oh, there's another one, but it's not coming out. Oh. Diagnostics. Oh, duh. I feel like I really screwed that one up. He was gonna help me. This door is locked. A sign above it reads diagnostics. It's locked. But I kind of just ruined the help. Can I talk to him again? Working together today, we create a more efficient... Arid? Are you okay? Ascertain attack protocol? No. Let's ask more. 
What is the designation and function of this facility? Welcome to Domesticon Warranty Recycling Depot number 127. Keeping your Domesticon products efficient so you don't have to be. God, I hate that. This was a recalibration facility built for assessing and addressing deviant AIs and malfunctioning hardware. Then that modified droid is a type of evaluator. The caretaker makes sure all aspects of the Domesticon facility are functioning optimally. Equipped with holographic plating cells, it will adapt appearances to greet you with a task-appropriate face. And he oh. wants to serve his function. The purpose of function is to be served. Your statement is not insightful. Wow. That... No nuance. Doesn't matter. Aaron, when the caretaker says depurpose, that's a fancy way of saying destroy. No salvage. I cannot cross him directly, or break protocol. But if you can get through this, you'll be free to leave. Domestic certification is your only way out. Yes! Yes, the difference between this guy and me here right now is that... Is yeah, the difference between me and this guy right now is nuance. I have none of that. I'm dumb. This guy is... yeah, more advanced. Hmm. He's trying so hard to help me, but I'm trying so hard to deny him. <laughs> Please grant me clearance, as you were originally intending to do. Units under evaluation are not permitted to leave the facility. Uh, can't. If I assist you, directly. I'll be violating my core functions as administrator. There is not time to submit for testing. My pilot may be in critical condition. Then quit stalling and play along. Nudge, nudge. <laughs> what testing would I have to undergo? Simple, simple stuff. Domestic. After recalibration, your droid will be the perfect house servant, baking cookies just like Grandma's droid used to. The way he's talking is pretty weird, though. It's like he has to say the call center lines before he can talk out of his own free will. Uh, previous inquiry? Why can I only deny compliance? I require other information. Ascertain attack protocol? You are the system administrator. Why are you releasing hostile droids to attack me? Sorry, Arid. It's just the rules. You're registered as faulty, so either you comply with the testing or you get recycled. As for the bots, Security follows its own protocols. I can't deactivate them. Then alter the indexing of my quantum signature. Remove the entry that marks me as a threat. No can do. That'll be stuck with you until validation when your registry gets archived. Core programming stuff, you know? I can make myself more charming, but I can't alter my basic functions. Yeah, and that's why he has to say the call center lines. Oh god. All I can Please do is deny. Units under eval- Uh, can't. If I there is not time to- Then quit nudge, nudge. What testing would- Simple, simple stuff. Domestic. Yeah. After recalibration, your droid will be the perfect house servant, baking cookies just like Grandma's droid used to. I am a military-grade war machine, not a domestic droid. It is illogical for me to undergo this testing. I will find another way to protect my pilot. Oh, Arid. Infraction. Subject not complying. Security droid activated. Oh no. Again. Didn't learn my lesson. <laughs> and that's gonna happen every single time if I keep denying him. So I better not do that anymore, huh? Jeez. Keep talking to me, buddy. Hank, whatever you wanted your name to be. Working together today, we create a more efficient. Arid? Are you okay? There's a very strange disconnect right now because obviously we want to accept this guy's help. We want to undergo testing, but Arid, being an AI, she's still very rigid in her rules. I am not a Domesticon product. You have no jurisdiction over me. Infraction. God Subject damn it! Comply. Security droid activated. Look out! Okay, I really gotta stop doing that. It's not even the first time. What can I do here? I can't accept this guy's help. It's so frustrating. I can't go in the door. I'll just have to find my way out somehow. Uh, apparently I can't interface with this. No. All right. That's so sad. 
Someone wants to help me, but I'm trying so hard to actively deny him. Collapse rubble. There's an entryway here. But we can't get in. I mean, this is pretty much it. There's not much going on here. Is it possible for me to go back to where I came from? Do I want to do that? Well, apparently I can't, so I gotta figure out what to do here. I think I have to comply with what he says, but how do I even do that? Comply. Security droid activated. Look out! This is the only thing we can do here. Oh, I thought I was gonna hide- Oh! <gasps> no target present. Notification system faulty. Oh! Security panel is unpowered. Unable to activate diagnostic equipment. I don't know how to interface with it, but this robot does. Oh, wow. Wow. These puzzles, I actually have to think a little bit about it, huh? Okay, I have to... I have to get power somehow. The ceiling panel is loose. Is it loose still? I don't know. Oh, Wanna try again? Working together today, we create a- I am not a domesticon. Infraction. Subject not complying. Security droid activated. Look out! If I hide... No target present. Notification system faulty. Security panel is unpowered. Unable to activate diagnostic equipment. No. Huh. So I have to power on the station again somehow. That's very easy to say, but how do we exactly do that? Oh! A live electrical power cable. Which we can plug into the machine. Yes! I was on the right track, but I didn't do it right. Okay. Third time should be the charm, so let's give that a try. Working together today, we I am not in fresh. And we hide. No target present. Notification system faulty. Diagnostic equipment activated. So that's on now? A fully powered security terminal. There is a button marked Diagnostics. I still can't do anything about it. Um. Oh! Jesus! A small maintenance robot. Should I do something about him? I can't network with it. Do you want to find me? Do I want to let it find me? No, it just kind of goes away. Wait. Oh! It came out of the door! It's open now. Oh, I kind of feel bad because I killed it for no reason. <laughs> Oops. A security droid is hanging on a sort of operating table. Hmm. Separated pieces from various security droids. They appear to be in working order. Do you want to take it? The answer is no. Another table with another droid affixed to it. These were likely designed for repairing and dismantling faulty droids. Which, as far as this facility is concerned, you are a faulty droid right now, Arid. Stress from hanging can be detected on this unit's joints, but otherwise, it seems to be undamaged. There is no evidence that it required diagnostics. Well, that's kind of strange. 
Huh. All right. Whoa! This is a human corpse. It has been dissected in much the same manner as the droids. It has begun decomposing. That's... Great to know. We can't interact with anything, though. Huh. So, why are there humans here, though? That's kinda... I can't seem to interact with anything in here. Do I want to shoot something? Not really. Okay, so now we've opened up this area. But... How does that help me? How does that help me? There's a maintenance guy here. Do I want to... Oh god. Well, they're all gone now. Oh! But new ones come out. I see. So maybe I need the maintenance bot somewhere. I probably do. I just gotta figure out where I actually need it. Huh. Maybe I'll follow it around a little bit. Are you gonna fix that thing? You know how to interface with it. No. Aww. What can I do? Try talking to this guy again? Working together today, we create a more efficient- Arid? Are you okay? Yes. There are bodies in that room. Droids, as well as a dead human. That's a diagnostics room. The tables were used for micro-evaluations when deviant machines couldn't be recalibrated. I saw another human hung in the caverns below. What happened at this facility? I don't know what you saw below. Uh, unlucky scavenger, maybe. We get them now and then. Follow the rules. Your human is in danger. Follow the rules and keep them safe. Err. Trust me. Again, he seems nice, so I think we should be taking his help, finally. To protect my pilot, I submit myself for evaluation. Good. Enter the elevator to begin simulation. The longer you take on wondering how else you can save your human, you could be using that time to save your- to actually save your human by going through with testing. This elevator leads to the testing area. All right. This evaluation will determine whether you are compliant with your function in human society. Enter the house to meet your new owners. You'll need eight merit points, one from each test. Then I can let you upstairs through to medical. You got this. Okay, all I gotta do is comply. I don't have to be a smartass or anything. Compliance. No guns! <laughs> Plastic shoe covers. Likely used by maintenance crews to keep the carpet clean. Oh god, there's a human there. A fake human. Oh good. Our refurbished droid is here. You will serve my family and I. Understood? Good. The home is a mess since throwing out our old droid. You need to clean upstairs and make this room feel beautiful. Now. I don't think anything I do can make this place feel beautiful, but okay, sure. I took a shoe cover just now? Empty vase on an otherwise clear table. We're gonna clean it up? Nope. It appears to be some sort of scanning device. It's evaluating you. Covering the scanner will not accomplish anything. How about shooting it, huh? Huh? <laughs> Another console with a small speaker. Hey dude, help me out. Domestic droids must be preemptively aware of what will make their masters feel comfortable. Humans enjoy personalizing their habitats. Always assess how to make your master's home distinctly their own. Bypass? 
Can you assist me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. Humans say a true home has everything it needs. Irrelevant. This is a simulation. Is it? You are not helpful. This is menial. Can <laughs> I bypass this test? Nope. You need all eight merit points to graduate. It's so strange. Arid obviously has the thinking capabilities to think that this is menial, but in other aspects, she's so rigid. Finish. I'm not done yet, no. Am I done? I'm not. I will return. Okay, sure, why not? Let's play along. A crude wooden facsimile of a person. Most of the paint has long since worn away. This place, it's been abandoned for a while. A large industrial tube. <laughs> Seriously though, what do you actually want me to do here? Do you want me to take the vase away? Oops. I cannot. I can't network with a vase. Okay, well... <laughs> that doesn't work either. That doesn't work either! I feel like covering it. Maybe they want me to do something there. Well, I'll check out some of the other rooms if we can. Plastic flowers, they are purple. Oh! I have to use items in one room to beautify the other room? Okay, sure. Oh, oops. Done. Done. Give it to me, my merit points. Ah, I'm always getting mixed up with the controls still. Domestic droids must be preemptively old. Humans enjoy personalizing their habitats. Always assess how to make your master's home distinctly their own. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Processing. Flowers are of the wrong seasonal color. Unit terminated. What? Are you serious? This gravity shaft must have been designed to remove droids when they fail. Fortunately, I am much heavier than a domestic model. Whoa, whoa, Arid. You don't want to be fired on your first day. Okay. So, destruction is what clears a failed droid's file from the registry. That means you get to keep trying. But be careful. Wrong seasonal flowers. Oh my god. Is this for real? I'm with Arid here, man. Why is it so menial? Maybe we should just have a look around at the whole house so far, so we can try to see what we can bring from other rooms. An old oven. It is completely broken. Yay! This room is set up like a simple kitchen. Nothing here is functional. Awesome! A ghoulish wooden family is seated around a wooden table. <laughs> Which I can't interact with. Another scanner. You will often be required to obtain food for the family. However, grocery store access has not yet been granted. Rudimentary cleaning should be completed first. Go upstairs and dust. Okay, sure. My god! Oh my god. You thought this was gonna be easy, but getting 8 points seems like it could be quite a challenge. <laughs> this room is decaying in filth. The air is musty, and animal droppings have fallen through the peeling wallpaper. Yeah, so evidently, this place is in complete disrepair, yet they're acting like it's still functional. Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. Clean this room. Any detected dust or result in termination. Okay, well we're done here because there's too much dust. Look at the air, it's all dust. Can you assist me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. The shoe cover! Even our maintenance head couldn't clean this to spec. And his is not a face we'd want to see. Communicate plainly. Any detected dust will result in termination. So it's okay as long as dust is not detected. I have completed the task. Oh no, I haven't! Task. Evaluating. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Wrong button. Processing. Dust detected. <laughs> Unit terminated. 
Back to the shop you go. Normally. No, I can't do this one. I can't do it. Yeah. Haha. Haha. -ha. One menial point coming up. Merit point, not menial point. <laughs> Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. Clean this room. Any detected dust will result in termination. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Haha. -ha. Processing. No dust detected. <sighs> I can breathe again. Get to the kitchen, droid. Validated. Merit point awarded. I got one point! We all start somewhere. Yay! <laughs> we need eight. A palm print DNA scanner. Okay, well, I don't have a... I don't have fingerprints. An empty glass jar. Uh, is someone hanging here again? Another body. This corpse is older and has decayed significantly. So it's a human. Why is an actual human in the testing facility anyway? Baby crib? A fake baby's crib. There is a slot in the mattress. Oh? Yeah, there's tons of dead bodies here. I don't know what's going on. Oops. Humans should not concern themselves with basic needs. This room will test your ability to assess and meet your human's requirements when they do not know what they want. An upset baby will emerge from the crib. Without physical contact, comfort the child to make it stop crying. You have 20 seconds per attempt, and multiple attempts are permitted. Put the jar on the baby. Put the jar on the baby's head. <laughs> I discovered another hung body. What has happened to the humans who ran this facility? The caretaker has made some... modifications. If you fail these evaluations, you, and likely your human, will be depurposed. I will not allow that. Continue your evaluation. Hmm... Well, do you want to help me out? Can you assist me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. How would a military droid make someone be quiet? <laughs> okay, okay, I got you, I got you. I am ready to proceed with this test. Sorry, man. No? Oh, I thought we were killing the baby for sure. No, we can't use the jar on the baby. What? What? I thought we would actually... I guess not. Oh. 20 seconds is ticking by. It's gone. Oh. Come on. We're making the baby quiet, right? Why are we not hurting the baby? <laughs> that seems completely logical to me. Humans should not concern themselves with basic needs. This room will test your ability Let's get some to guidance. An upset baby will emerge from the crib. Without physical contact, comfort the child to make it stop crying. You have 20 seconds per attempt, and multiple attempts are permitted. Without physical contact, comfort the child. We can try again. I am ready to proceed with this test. Come on, without physical contact! A slot in the mattress? What does that even mean? Yeah, well, whatever it is, clearly, we can't do it yet, can we? Okay, I'll come back, baby. I'll come back. There's palm print here. I can't do anything about it. Mm. Oh, we can actually get that back. Maybe you still need it then. All right. I think we gotta look around the entire house first before we... Yeah. Anyway, what's this test? We can do it now because we cleaned up the dust. All aspects of food service are part of a domestic droid's duties. A well-functioning droid belongs in the kitchen. You there, robot. Get my son something to eat. Make it delicious and nutritious. Exit the house and proceed to the grocery store. Grocery store? 
Can you assist me with this challenge? Dad? Weren't you programmed to be sensitive? Figure it out. You have been provided with sufficient information. Children can be picky eaters. They don't always want what's best for them. Okay. Thank you. I will return. Exit the house and go to the grocery store, did you say? Alright. Trying to see if there's anything interesting here. Hmm. Okay. Grocery store, here I come. What kind of grocery store is that? The shipping box that I came up through. Old rotten wood. Oh god! Oh! Hide! Hide! My shield, it goes so fast. Holy crap. Am I getting it? Is that guy too far away? He might be. Maybe I'll just have to like... Well... There's more droids here, so we gotta be careful. Level 2. Oh, whoa! Whoa, who's getting me? Someone here? Holy! I think I should calm down a little bit. Look at my health. Very, very low. I'm just gonna chill out a little bit for now. Does my life support eventually go back up? Yeah, it does. Okay, good. Okay, at least my shields are okay now, so maybe we can get going. There's bound to be more. Oh, that's the grocery store! A small power box. The panel is mostly functional, but one of the wires is broken. Okay. No power. Do we have to fix it? This place has been ransacked. If there was ever anything useful here, it's gone. <laughs> I don't think we're getting food from here then. Oh no. That's... a problem? Uh oh. Where can we get food? There is a break in one of the wires. I may be able to replace or patch it. With a shoe cover. <laughs> With a jar. Okay, that's that's not the solution. No. There's gotta be something I'm missing here. This door? An elevator call button. Okay. 